Hey, good morning, everybody. I am in a good mood today because the weather is gorgeous. It is literally a Chamber of Commerce day here in Florida. We have low humidity, 75, blue skies. Literally no clouds in the sky. I love it. And we're going on the boat. We got Mac in the back. And we're going out to Anclote Island. We are, which is pretty close to where we live, and we have never really been there. I know. Can you believe it? It's like the place to go, and we just haven't gone. <laughs> so, uh, but there's a lot to do there. You can primitive camp. There's a big sandbar on the north end of the island. Uh, there's a lighthouse, lighthouse you can visit. Yeah, some boardwalks. And yep. So we're so, going to go explore. Yes. And, uh, of course, have some food. Oh, of course, we have to eat our lunch on the sandbar, yes. so that so, is a given. Yes, yeah, so come along with us and enjoy this incredible oh, day. It's beautiful out here. Let's get out there. Let's do it. <laughs> okay, we've launched at uh, Sunset Beach, and it is low tide. So it got really shallow here. <laughs> Joel got out and is pulling us along. <laughs> and then we're gonna stake the boat out and head on and explore the island a little bit. All right, Mac is all staked out and secure and we're headed to the lighthouse. <laughs> But it is very low tide right now. Yes, it's uh, like walking across the moon. Look at that. that this is all going to be underwater. In a couple hours, this will be about three feet deep of water. So we can't be out here too long or we'll be swimming out back to Mac. <laughs> so the lighthouse was built in 1887. And, uh, oh, I keep stepping in holes. <laughs> so, Sorry. Yeah. Anyway, so we're going to go check it out. It was built in 1887, was, and there is a ranger that stays out here. Yes, there is. Um, yep. All the time. Yeah, all the time. I so, don't know exactly what for. Just to keep crazy people like us away from the lighthouse, probably. <laughs> probably. probably. We have hit a dead end. <laughs> so there's a boardwalk right there, and we want to get on that boardwalk, but we thought that you could get from there the to south, here. But the South Beach. No but... can do. So we're going to maybe get back in Mac. I think it's probably too far to hoof it around and uh, see if we can figure out how to get on that boardwalk. <laughs> Apparently we were on the right side of the island. Um, we just needed to come a little bit further down. So we have to be 150 feet from the ranger's dock, or yep. dock, yeah. Um, and so we parked the boat out there and now I think we see the entrance to the uh, the boardwalk. We hope so. Big we hope so. <laughs> yeah. So just so everybody knows, dogs are prohibited on the island. So I'm glad we didn't bring Skylar on this trip. And we have officially arrived on Anclote Key Preserve State Park. And there's the boardwalk. We're going down. We finally found the entrance. Look. <laughs> made it to the lighthouse. It is about 0.35 miles on the boardwalk. On the boardwalk, yep. yep. So just good to know. And there are some mosquitoes out oh here. Oh my gosh, I'm getting eaten <laughs> like crazy. So, so what are a couple more facts of the lighthouse? Yep, so it's 110 feet tall. Yep. And uh, 127 steps from the lower deck up to the top. And they do have, I read something about, um, you can go up there certain times of like oh, the month or something like that. You should find that out, yeah. So, and um, actually it was, um, it kind of fell into decay and people vandalized it and everything else. So back in 2003, they had a complete restoration oh. and brought it back to its normal, be like pristine state. There you go. So now we can all enjoy it. It says that the uh, light automated in November of 1952 and mm -hmm. the keeper retired. So I guess there was a, a lighthouse keeper up there until that, then. That'd be a great job. I know, right? I do, yes. <laughs> all right, so right now they have a fence around it but super cool though pretty neat little structure and you can it doesn't look that tall here but you can see it we've seen it from the water yeah you from can miles see it away from yeah right yeah. 
Well, that's probably good is since it's a lighthouse. <laughs> you want to see it from far away. <laughs> good point, right? You're smart. <laughs> this is where we were before and uh, the boat was parked out there and we just couldn't make it up here. But that was a good little walk. Beautiful out here. Okay, we're gonna leave the that part of the island. We're gonna go around the south bend. South tip. South tip. Over to the Gulf side. The Gulf side, which is the beach side. Yes. And we heard the beach is beautiful. Beautiful. We're gonna find out. So the great thing about Anclote Island is that even if you don't have a boat, you can take one of these little ferries out and uh, it leaves from Carpen Springs Sponge Docks. It brings you right out to the island and you can come hang out for the day. We've done it once before and it's a, it's a really nice little drive. So we put the anchor down and uh, it's a little rough over here, but it's just regular surf, I guess. I'm gonna go take a little walk on the beach. Look how beautiful this beach is. They do have some driftwood. Pretty cool. Which makes it really cool. Slice of paradise, Amy. Slice yeah. of paradise. Yeah, it is. Joel is going to try and fly his drone, but horrible at this. he doesn't have very good luck. So we'll usually have a battery that's dead or... <laughs> Sometimes you run into things. <laughs> Not very often, but. Nice. <laughs> so if there's no video, that's because nothing turned out. Sorry. <laughs> and we have lift off. Hopefully you saw some beautiful footage of Anclote Island. If not, I'm sorry. <laughs> there we go. All right, we're back on the boat and heading to the sandbar on the north side of the island. Right? Yes. That's where we're going. That's where we're going. Let's go. <laughs> Take the hat off so it doesn't fly away. We are on the sandbar and uh, we have no idea where the best part on the sandbar is. So we just stopped and it's uh, what, shin, shin deep? Less, yep, than shin. less than shin deep. A little wavy down here. I think there's more sand like up there, but I think we're also at high tide. So it's coming up. yeah, it is coming up. So uh, we're gonna grab some lunch. The water's a little chilly though. <laughs> the water's like 83 instead of 90. <laughs> Joel just made fun of me because I said it was cold. Now he said it's too cold. We got it going slowly. It's cold. <laughs> and maybe getting a little too late in the season to be sandbar in ish, huh? Never too late. <laughs> Not in Florida. So we ended up moving the boat a little bit. We did, only about a couple hundred yards, but it made a huge difference. It's just not as windy, not as deep. There's actually a bunch of sand here. Yep, and so this is actually, a, with dry land, so it's breaking the wind here, and the let's, waves. Let's look at the, gorgeous, huh? It's beautiful. All right, we're gonna enjoy this for a little bit. Yes. All right, so there's like, thousand seagulls all over the sandbar <laughs> and every fiber of my being wants to just chase after and make them fly everywhere <laughs> but i'm not gonna do it because i'm an adult <laughs> adults don't do things like that no of course no. not <laughs> he couldn't resist <laughs> uh. 
Couldn't resist, huh? Couldn't resist. <laughs> Look, they're all over now. We've been surrounded. But they're all coming back. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Couldn't resist. They just moved down a little further down that way. <laughs> okay, we've got one more stop. We are going back to the island, Anklod Island, and there is supposedly a place for primitive camping, and we saw online that there's a sign someplace, so we're on the search for that, so we can go primitive camping at some point when it gets a little bit cooler. Okay, we think we saw the primitive camping area. There were some tents there on the north side of the island, and there might even be a porta potty over there, but uh, it was kind of rough up to... Uh, to anchor so we're just gonna look it up online and hopefully we can get um, out there sometime soon all right we're gonna say goodbye while we're on the water yes we are uh, ending this trip just drifting her across the grass flats with the engine off it's quiet it's beautiful it, there's nobody around Super so I peaceful. love it well yeah. some people just pulled up back there but <laughs> you know they, they won't bother us nah. <laughs> So uh, this was a great little island, this Anclode Island, yeah. and uh, we'll definitely be back. Whether it's to the sand, to the sandbar, or to the beach, maybe with some some fishing poles. <gasps> Joel should have brought his fishing poles this I time. Should've. I should. You, you could have watched me catch nothing. <laughs> but he saw fish. <laughs> he, he saw them. <laughs> You just did. may not catch them. No. <laughs> so if you enjoyed the adventure, please subscribe to the channel. Bloop, bloop. And uh, we'll catch you all on our next adventure. Thanks guys for coming along. Have a glorious day. Bye.